Hello, your Majesty, and welcome now to Thursday. Thanks for logging in. Well, sunny and social, or perhaps socially sensitive today, the ruling planet of the moon is in the house of friends and society, so you're definitely emotionally sensitive to your circle of friends, public reputation, campaigns that you might have, even maybe the title on your business card. In fact, the moon is showing a potential breakthrough when it comes to your emotional perception of you in the world, but let's get back to that in a minute. First, I want to talk about the sun. In chapter two of Sun and Scorpio, yesterday having Uranus breakdown energy, today Mercury ruling the day, which means we'll be processing and breaking through. So today's a day of, con uh, of conversation and processing. Now that said, the topic is how well grounded you are. That's what Leos are working on, a solid home, a solid castle, so that you can be strong. And part of that castle is that you eat, that you sleep, that you take care of yourself. This is the survival vibration, and this is the vibration that cancers are quite good at, or it comes naturally to them. Although sometimes you get the anti-cancers who live on the dark side of the moon, and they're not. Either way, though, that's true with every sign, it's time for you to develop a healthy regimen and create a nice potting soil for your soul garden. Now, back to the moon. The moon today in the next 24 hours shows potential breakthrough because we have a temporary soul pyramid in air. That means we're emotionally going to take three areas of our life and kind of mix it all together and come to a new emotional conclusion. And I think the conclusion for Leos will be feeling different in the world, feeling a different role, a different place in the world. What this will combine are three areas. One, your approach to long-term relationships, business partnerships, romances, etc. The second, your overall attitude on life, represented by Venus down there in the third house. So your attitude on life, your attitude about relationships, leading to a shift in how you feel you belong in the world or not. Then also for shifting, we have Sadiqa Salter in a new episode of The Renegade Aromatherapist going live today. She's a plant kingdom expert, and in the celebration of Scorpio, she'll be giving out a plant essence that will help you draw the right boundaries or build the right castle, so to speak. So you don't want to miss Sadiqa. She's live everywhere. The SG and her television network streams. All right, Your Majesty, that's all I have for the day. I'll see you tomorrow with your weekend forecast. Live, love, be. So